Hello! Our today's topic is Manufacture of Sodium Carbonate by Solvay's Process So let's get started Solvay's Process is used to manufacture sodium carbonate because we use sodium carbonate for many purposes This sodium carbonate is produced in industries Now what are industries? Industries are the places where we use raw materials and form new products. The principle of Solvay's process is to manufacture sodium carbonate at low temperature. The raw materials that we need to start our industry are sodium chloride NaCl or brine, limestone CaCO3 and ammonia NH3. We shall provide all these things to industry to manufacture the required product. But we don't need to give these things all the time. Once we provide our raw materials, we will set up our industry in such a way that after the manufacture of product, we will again have our raw materials. This is the flow chart of our industry. We will discuss each step accordingly. There are four chambers in this industry. First is ammoniating tower. Second is carbonating tower. Third is lime kiln. Fourth is ammonia recovery tower. We will provide ammonia gas, sodium chloride, and water to ammoniating tower. The mixture of these substances is called ammonical brine. After the preparation of ammonical brine, the ammonical brine is passed into carbonating tower, carbon dioxide pass through it, and these reactions takes place. Firstly carbon dioxide, ammonia, and water, gives NH4 hours CO3. This product is intermediate and speedily give its reaction with NaCl brine and form sodium bicarbonate and ammonium chloride. The temperature is lowered to 15 degrees and sodium bicarbonate is obtained. After obtaining we will filter the product for the less chances of useless impurities. After the filtration, we take sodium bicarbonate and heat it because we are manufacturing sodium carbonate. After heating it we will obtain sodium carbonate, carbon dioxide, and water. This process is called calcination. Thus we have manufactured our required product, which is sodium carbonate. But as we have discussed earlier, that we should set up our industry in such a way, that at the end, our raw materials will again produced. Here we are also seeing CO2 and water. So now we are gonna set up industry in this way. We will introduce a new chamber in our industry that is called lime kiln. We will provide CaCO3 in it. CaCO3 decomposes and produce calcium oxide and carbon dioxide. This carbon dioxide goes to carbonating tower. Thus our first raw material is produced. The calcium oxide reacts with water that was formed when we heated sodium bicarbonate to sodium carbonate. They both react with each other and form calcium hydroxide, which goes to our last chamber, that is ammonia recovery tower. The ammonium chloride that was formed during decomposition of sodium bicarbonate and the calcium hydroxide which was formed in lime kiln they both react and form ammonia water and calcium chloride ammonia is reused while the other products goes out now we shall summarize the whole topic First chamber we have ammoniating tower. We will provide sodium chloride, water, 
and ammonia to this chamber. This mixture is called ammonical brine. This ammonical brine is fed into carbonating tower, in which carbon dioxide is passed, which produces sodium bicarbonate and ammonium chloride. This sodium bicarbonate changes to sodium carbonate. Thus sodium carbonate is our required product. Now we will manufacture our raw materials. We introduce a new chamber which is lime kiln. Calcium carbonate heated. And produce carbon dioxide which goes to carbonating tower. Here calcium chloride is also produced. Which reacts with water. And goes to ammonia recovery tower. At which ammonia is recovered. The ammonium chloride produced in carbonating tower goes to ammonia recovery tower. In this chamber, ammonia is recovered while the other product goes out. So that was our today's lecture. I hope you understand. If you feel any queries, please ask them in the comment box. And don't forget to subscribe our channel to get the notification of our upcoming videos. Bye.